Oh man. There's only supposed to be one. Let's go. I'm try not to mess around with these guys if it can be avoided. 17, right on the button. That's exactly what I needed. Uh, let's... Boost. He must have taken a lot less damage than the other one. Because I didn't have him set as the... Uh, the main receiver of damage. Oh, I don't have enough for Nourish. Shoot, kind of wasted that one. He resisted and I still did 23. Feeling light. I'm just early on that one too. I feel like I'm timing it up right, but... Yay! Plus one to mana? That's not a bad idea. Suit of physical attack. Plus two to physical attack. I kind of, I, I like rolling, rolling with it like that. Anytime I plan things, it just goes poorly anyways, so. We'll leave it up to fate. We don't get our health back when we level up? Why did I think we did? going on in here and that's that gets us out is this a wall the music is good I'm I've, I've been digging it I was just actually about to say that but uh, I don't know what I don't know if that's a is that a flute Did anybody tell it's like a ocarina almost I uh, I approve man video game music is great Hold on. Is this the way forward? This looks like it is the way forward. Let's go back down. I did not finish what I was doing over there. Ocarina? Yeah. That's how I've always heard it pronounced. I've heard people say ocarina. I don't, I don't know which one it is specifically. Oh yeah, that was just that was just straight up the exit. Son of a. Should we run a poll on how you pronounce it? Is it Ocarina or Ocarina? Well, okay. That was the way forward. Ocarina is what you've always heard? How does Webster's <laughs> have it written? It could be. I think I used to say Ocarina, and then I heard people say Ocarina, and I'm like, oh, I've been saying it wrong the whole time.
We gotta heal. I was thinking we'd get close to uh, potentially having some like a like a camp. It's been a long time since I don't think we've, I don't know if we've had a place to camp since we got here. Are they fighting? Let's go. Um, Oak is incorrect. He was from climbing multiple ledges. It's just holding the A button with a going over down. Oh, you mean not okay? Not like actually climbing, but like going up, um, like ledges and stuff. You said ledges. I know. I yeah. You. I don't know. I read that. I, ladders and and rocks are what jumped into mind. I got you. Moonerang. Let's do. We're not gonna be able to get the sun part though. Too early. Son of a gun. Oh, and that didn't even count. Oh, and actually, yes, that did. That did do the sun. That's right. I gotta remember that. Um, if I power him up, this then I can use the sun thing. Good job. Hit him hard. Oh. That was terrible. Can't do it. I just can't do it. See what a three charge looks like before I nourish. <laughs> Big heals. 60? Okay. Oh, I finally blocked one. Whoops. I thought he was going to throw his bombs. that is. Obviously, we don't know yet. Campfire. That's good news. Finally time for coffee. Congratulations. You did it. Shouldre. 8 MP. Okay. 35 and 5. We'll take that. Let's make that. Uh, my gosh, we can make so many of those. Let's make four of these. No, let's make three of these. I like how we built like a mobile oven to make a roast sandwich.
chose correctly. Or teal amber ores. What the hell is this? Get out of my way. Okay, nothing else up here. I thought so, but I just wanted to check again. Time has made the ruins indecipherable. So we have the ability to control time from day to night. I wonder if we can go back in time. What do I want to do here? Let's boost. Let's hit him with some sun. I just realized I, I never actually rested at that that campfire today. I just hung out, made some food, and went on with my day. So after this fight, I'm gonna do just that. Go ahead and set ourselves up with uh, a save with full health this time. I wonder if enemies return. They don't. Good. I don't mind that souls mechanic sometimes. I don't know, this game should not have souls mechanics, but I'm just saying. <laughs> Seems like the kind of thing that could happen. This has probably got a bunch of enemies in it. One of these is going to be bad news. Oh, we can go even further down. Uh, have you made it to the settlement building? I think I heard that's a thing in one of the... Reviews. No, I have not yet. I don't think. No, unless it's got a really bad name. Knows there's too many. Hmm, that's a problem. I didn't know they could do that. Uh, let's go. I do sun, I can hit three. Maybe we do sunball there? Good. I feel like moonerang is gonna be really hard when I have unless he unless she moves to a better spot.
Do 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 do. could throw the enemy elsewhere would I so I could use hurl as like a I can use it like strategically to like throw an enemy closer to another enemy or I guess I didn't that didn't even cross my mind silver sword I love the treasures in this game I just love that everyone has some sort of like you know it's, it's a new piece of armor. Well, it's not all of them, but a new piece of armor, a new weapon. Like, that's... I miss that so much from old RPGs. I'm glad Holly's job just got suspended for... Okay. Should have been fired. Should have been fired. Yes, absolutely. Should have been fired. 100%. Suspended. That's it, huh? We can do this. We can go... Um, maybe not. We can do two of them. I can't get the third one. Don't have enough magic. Okay, so an interesting thing to keep in mind, the second attack, if you, if you charge, apparently the second attack doesn't carry the, I guess maybe unless it's level two, it doesn't carry the, um, the magic affinity with it. Weird. The game does explain what little boxes with icons next to the enemies are. Yes. Yes, yes, it does. And it actually is I what I think I think it's it's pretty cool. It's it's a it's a fun part of uh fun, it's pretty early on. So you if you haven't seen it, you very much will shortly. Five is a lot. But I hope that's enough. Good. It is. Going to bed as children? Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, it shouldn't take you long to get... The, the, prolo the prologue was kind of extended, but it wasn't too bad. I should have charged him up. It all worked out. Do, 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 do. What's this? What are you? All kinds of mysterious things. Like that. Oh, it's a save point. Some wild lettuce. Yeah, that gets a bit late. Rock lid. That looks like a new weapon for Garl. Ruby.
Well, and I guess in like, I mean, that's that's staying up four hours past when you get done working. So it's not like it's it is late, but I guess if you flip that around and like you had a job where you worked, you know, eight hours during the day. Yeah, that's that's tough. That's something I just I could never adjust to. Um, no, I don't want to do that. Like, where did you come from? Oh, let's see. Let's go. See if we can. Well, this will at least cancel one of the attacks. Hey, bud. Oh, thank you. Yeah! <laughs> oh man. I can't believe it didn't kill those other two! Or it wasn't even close! What's up, you? You just freaking out or what? Magic in the game is strong. Magic is it's 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 strong and it's cool. What's the problem? Calm, <laughs> calm. Come on. What are you doing? You wanna come say hi? <laughs> Everybody, Jack's here. <laughs> Bird is here. Lone Wolf's here. Does my sweatshirt still fit? Yeah, your sweatshirt still fits, right? The one that Bird got you? The mm -hmm. Under Armour one? Yeah. Yeah, I think you got it good enough. Or like, big enough for him. Works out well. Thank you, Bird. Ah, uh, there you go. You got biggies now? I know. <laughs> what are we doing tonight? We're going to my orientation. <laughs> orientation. You missed, you, you mixed orientation and organization. <laughs> Called it an organi, org, what did you say? Organization? I don't know. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's pretty pumped. It'll be fun. Grandma's gonna be there. Grandma works at his school and she, conveniently, this will be her first year in the kindergarten classrooms. I want to get that. Drop from above, maybe? Stone Mason Outpost, Fishing Lake. We're going to go there. We're gonna jump in. We're going to try to see if we can't wrap around here. Oh, yeah. This is looking good. This is looking good. Is Jack in the board game area yet? Is that something Bird can pass along? He likes, uh, you know, we play, we play like Andy Land. Uh, play, he plays Life and things like that. He, you know, he enjoys. Yeah, he enjoys games. Recipe for mushroom soup. Uh, no, I want to go to the fishing lake. That's right. Yeah, but. And it's now. Oh, good. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, we don't need to. Apparently, there's signs that we might have a mouse. I don't know. Wouldn't surprise me. We have mouse traps set up. 
know that. Uh, do y'all love Hay Bear on YouTube for the baby as much as everyone else seems to? Kate, is the dancing fruit Hay Bear? Yeah, apparently we do. <laughs> I need to heal. Delilah's obsessed. Yeah, I I didn't I never knew what that was when Jack was young. It must be something newer. I better use something. Are <laughs> they watching that on TV while I get to use my phone for the stream? Yeah, baby, baby dominates, I understand. We all got heals in, so that's that's good. Ah, we got it. It's a block. Alright, I finally got the timing of that enemy down. Who are you? I, are you all three of them? I'm all three of them, yep. Do you have so much energy that you don't know what to do with yourself? You are bouncing all over the place. Ah, all done. All done. All done. I don't have enough magic to do anything meaningful to any of these enemies. Unless if I if I just attack, if I just charge and have magic imbued in my attack, does that do more? Yeah. A little bit. We kind of have to keep attacking just to make sure that we, uh, generate MP. Let's do this. Okay, so we got that one. Oh. Oh, no, side. It's, God, the combat is weirdly deep. It just, like, I notice after I attack sometimes, I'm just like, oh yeah, there's that functionality. Like, the idea that I was so focused on, uh, this is the fishing link, right? I was so focused on making sure, like, I did enough damage that I forgot that I cancel their attack if I, you know, hit them twice with my blunt weapon or whatever in that instance. I just... It's, it's, I like it. It's really, it's really cool. All right, lunar trout and two other fish. Listen to that plucking. Oh, you know what? It does, it does work better... It does work better when it's in that little lighter area, hard shell. Oh, okay. I get it now. I get it now. All right. It took me some attempts, but I totally understand the fishing now. Glad this is a fishing game. Doesn't seem too rough. It, well, it came with no explanation, so I think I got another lunar trout. Um, but I, I get it now. I, I, I wasn't understanding 
Thankfully, the first fish I caught was jumping out of the water and I could stun it. <laughs> I haven't had a fish that's done that since. Grass Haddock. That should be all three of these fish. I mean, I don't know if there's any completion rewards for that, but... If I see a fish, I'll, I'll, I'll get it. I'll go after it. So these enemies came back because I left. Oh, let's see. We could hit him with Sunball and make this a one, a one round thing, I believe. Oh yeah, that feels good. <clears throat> Look, someone's over there. We should ask for directions. She looks busy. Ah, I'm sure it's fine. <clears throat> Hello, is there something special about that big rock? Yes, come look at this. It's... This looks like... Nah, must be my imagination. Ahem, <clears throat> so what are those? Those small scenes do look good. They're, they're really well animated. Guys, yep. He is, he's a cyclops. Hey, AJ Respawn. Welcome back, bud. How are you? Fascinating is what they are. These ruins are the oldest form of writing known to us. Who's us? Traveling historians, of course. Or at least what's left of them. No way. You're a traveling historian? Nice to meet you. My name is Garl. Nice to meet you, too. I'm Teeks. So are your friends always this quiet? Nah, Zale and Valeria are fun. Or Valerie. And you know what? Maybe it is Valerie. Yeah. Just, I don't know. I, I, I think I got Zale right. Yeah, I think you're right, Lone Wolf. I think it is Valerie. Zale and Valerie are fun. They've just been uh, sealed away to study in the sky for too many years. <clears throat> How's my day? My day is fantastic. I don't know if you know anything about Sea of Stars, Jay Respawn, but so far, it's incredible. I love it a lot. One of the stories is going to get really goofy like it did the Messenger. The Messenger did get weird. That's right. I forgot about that. I didn't I didn't beat it um, because the side-scrolling, I, I just lost interest eventually, but that game did get weird. I got past like the, the, the big thing, but yeah, this game is a thousand percent more up my alley. Enchanted Cloth Pieces. You're Solstice Warriors. We... I knew it. Adventurous spirits fated un to unravel mysteries unknown, fearsome in battle, and encounter countless forgotten artifacts. I don't know if I read that in the right order. I don't know if it's supposed to be in an order. A traveling historian's best friends. It is the same world as the messenger? I didn't know that. I knew it was the same developers, but that's, that, yeah, that's, that's cool. I mean, well, someone's excited. And we thought Garl was something. Hey, guys. Teeks has an offer for us, and I think it's worth hearing her out. Sure, what's up? I'm not sure how to explain it properly. It's about my book. Why don't you eat with us tonight, Teeks? This place is perfect to set up camp. 
Oh, well. Don't be shy. We're happy to have you. <clears throat> yeah, plus you have to try Garl's cooking. I... Okay, thanks. That's it. One stew coming right up. Thanks again for the food, Garl. You really are a pretty good cook. Glad you liked it. You're welcome to join us again anytime. So you're the very last traveling historian? At this point, I might as well be the first. It's been so long since all the lore grimoires were burned. The devil confirmed it in an interview? Wow. Surprised they could pull that interview in the first place. Also, the devil exists. So that's something. The what now? Lore grimoires. Every traveling historian has one. Or had one, I suppose. <laughs> the devs. That makes way more sense. <laughs> Is this game cursed? They're enchanted books that write themselves by touching artifacts with stories to tell. Whoa. A traveling historian's duty is to make their lore grimoire as full as possible before passing it on to a new recruit. There used to be a guild and a whole bunch of us, but now there's just this believer here. Which leads to what I've been meaning to ask. Shoot. Well, you see, the best thing a traveling historian can ask for is adventurers who keep an eye out for them. I don't have a way to pay you, but if you wouldn't mind grabbing any artifacts you stumble upon during your adventures, I'd be happy to share stories with you. I would love to. Sounds fun, but how will we find you if you're always traveling? Don't worry about it. I'll just drop by your campfire whenever you're out in the open. It's the perfect setting for telling stories. I'm glad we're just going to approach that like that's a normal thing that would just happen. Story time by the campfire. Sign me up. Great. Just bring me any artifacts you find, and we'll see how my lore grimoire reacts. How many stories do you have so far? Just the one. It was empty when I found it, but that's okay by me. I plan on discovering enough to fill an entire volume. That's the spirit. This first story wrote itself when I stumbled upon a very old pirate earring. That's when I knew I was holding a real lore grimoire. They, f they were thought extinct. What's the story about? A ghost pirate ship called the Vespertine. Ooh. I can read it for you if you want. Feel free to ask. Story time? We will, but first, give me some food. Uh, nothing really new. We can make another roast sandwich. Let's make the chaudre. Chaudre. I don't know how to say it. We'll do that just because we, that way we have another way of getting some MP back. I wonder if we're going to be able to, like, upgrade that. Let's hear a story. Hold on. What else? What else do you guys say? I didn't even know traveling historians were a thing. I wonder how many of them there used to be. Story time at the campfire. Sign me up. With you, Garl. A tingling of ancient magic can be felt as if it had all but completely faded away over time. Thank you for the welcome back. Glad to be back. Hey, want to hear a story? Yes. The Vespertine. Now, is it just going to be dialogue, or is there fun scenes? Looks like just dialogue. Of all the recorded hexes and acts of bewitchment, few are as dreadful as the curse of the Vespertine. This story takes us back centuries to a time when a certain band of pirates ruled the seas. Stormcaller was the name of their captain. He was the most powerful wind mage the world had ever known. And their navigator, Hortense, remains to this day the shrewdest mariner on record. Combining Hortense's skills and Stormcaller's magic, some say their ship was faster than light itself. I doubt it. The crew went on many adventures and acclimated countless riches until one day, the inevitable happened. Hort uh, Hortense, whose first love was music, announced that she wanted to quit the pirate life and devote herself to her art full-time. Ever a firm believer that the real treasure is the treasure one finds along the way, Stormcaller took a resignation harshly, harshly. Utterly insulted, he stopped conjuring wind for the sails and locked the ship right in the middle of the ocean. And we shall remain here, he said, till our navigator gets that silly idea out of her head. But Hortons had already made her final decision. Days went by, both of them sulking while their crew begged that they reach some resolution. First they ran out of patience, then out of food, and eventually out of drinkable water. 
Then one day, after sunset, the pirates, driven mad by hunger and thirst, mutinied and made their captain walk the plank. As he sank into the abyss, Stormcaller cursed his crew and conjured an eternal prison. In the sea of nightmare, he would channel a deadly storm for them to endure forevermore. Over centuries, the crew members lost their minds to the ghastly place until only Hortons remained. To this day, the battle goes on in the sea of nightmare. Stormcaller's hatred pitted against the navigator's sheer will. Some say Stormcaller's fury will one day sink the ship, while others believe he will eventually bow to the indomitable Hortons. Legend has it she gets a short break once a day, or but a few seconds, at the precise time the curse was first conjured. Countless sailors and fishermen have since reported sightings of the legendary ghost pirate ship that appears at dusk. They call it the Vespertine. While some have half a mind to climb aboard in search of treasure, most avoid sailing at dusk for fear of being sucked into the sea of nightmare. The end. Well, I hope that's foreshadowing for somewhere we go. Good night, folks. Take a little rest. I'm glad I get a three-day weekend to really drive into this and I'm on core. Yeah, that'll be fun. Obviously, this three-day weekend does not mean that much to us, <laughs> since nothing really changes. Um, and Kate will start, I mean, I guess Kate starts work on Tuesday. So next Tuesday. Today's Tuesday. A week from today. Back to New York. Huh? A boat ride to Wraith Island. That might be a challenge given the situation with the lift. Probably nothing you can't figure out. Which way is it? East of here, along the path. Mind if I stick around for now? We have the same destination. The more the merrier. Teeks joins the cargo. Cargo. Yeah, Kay goes back a week from today. Is this still part of the demo bird? I don't think it is. None of this is familiar to me now. Feels like that demo part was... I thought it was bigger, but... None of this is in the demo? Okay. Blam! you missed all this? Well, this seems like main story path. I don't think anything that I've done is optional. If it was... The demo went this far, I'm sure this would be a part of it. Any plans on checking out Lies of P in a few weeks? I think so, but it just, it's just going to depend on my schedule and what I am what I got going on. I don't know. Lies of P is the soul, the, the Pinocchio Souls-like. <laughs> Duh. Yeah, Kate played the demo of it. Very Bloodborne inspired, yes. Um, there's a that that one. I think that one also has a demo. So if you want to try that out, there's a demo on PS5. There was. I don't know if there still is. Okay, we got to be faster. Whew, that was close. There's a puzzle in a town in the Oh, I remember the town. That's right. Learned combo skills, solar rain. Wait, hold on. Oh, wait, cargo. Interesting. So she she can't actually do anything. She's okay, that's that's why they said cargo. Apparently extra Extra party members are just called cargo. The demo went offline? Okay.
I thought the demo was hard. I never actually beat the... Actually, I, I never beat the boss, which I thought was the boss, but apparently there's two bosses in that demo. I never, I never beat them. Mountains are nice. That's the life. Mountains are nice. Okay. Who knows it? Here, take this. Hey, mushroom soup. That's why you pester people. You did beat them both? It was hard? Yeah, I just, I felt like that was the one complaint I had about Lies of P is like, I felt like I just was stuck in molasses. I felt like I just could not move as as quickly as I wanted to. I tried it like three or four times, and I'm like, you know what? I'll just play it on release. I was imp I was impressed with everything else. I just didn't. That, that fight wasn't wasn't doing it for me. Hey, you guys remember the story about the snake around the mountain? I think I found the snake. Stone Mason's Outpost. This is my kind of music. Oh, it changed. <laughs> the Elder hasn't returned. Malcolm, uh, <clears throat> Malcolmud will kill us all. Run. Who are you? Have you come to save us? Well, of course, they're solstice warriors. Carl, it's true, no? We should help if we can. What's the matter? It's Malcomud, the Earth Elemental Wizard. We're just a peaceful little outpost taking care of the mine's wind tunnels. I just hear my one complaint about Lies of P is that it's hard. Uh, I mean, my one complaint is that that boss fight was no good. It's our job, it is, to keep them unobstructed so that the wind can play the melody for the sleeper. But now, Malcomet has taken over the mines, so we can't go in anymore. And if the sleeper wakes, it will be the end of the world. Oh, he's a world leader. What's more, he clogged the tunnel powering the great elevator's windmill, so we can't even go to Brisk to ask for help. If this continues, Malcolm's minions will start pouring out of the mines. That was actually the other thing, Lone Wolf, is like, in the combat, I felt like I was missing something. Like, I, there was a part, like a gameplay thing that I either missed in the tutorial, or just wasn't explained and I never got it. So that might help too. I still will probably play it eventually if it's not on day one. It's okay, we're here to help. What happened next? They fixed dodging? Oh, okay, perfect, I'm all in. The Elder went in to try and stop him, but it's been so long. Is it my kind of game? Not, you're not a Souls fan, Timmy? Where's the entrance? I knew that, actually. Just up there, at the top of the outpost. But Malcomud is very powerful. Don't worry, we'll find your Elder. One evil wizard going down. Oh, what luck. Thank you. Yeah, let's go back to this music. Everyone, stop panicking. Solstice warriors are here to solve everything. This guy only yells. Don't tell Bark, but I, if I can, I put my games on easy. Nothing wrong with that. Absolutely nothing wrong with that. The Elder will return. Malcomed won't kill us all. Yay! I'll let you get on with it then. There's still lots for me to learn here. It wasn't cargo for long. Stonemason's Outpost. It's been about 20 minutes since I've said anything about this, but hey, this game makes me super duper happy. Also, I spit a little when I said that. <laughs> when I grow up, I want to work in the ground like my parents. Everyone was running around just a moment ago. Grown-ups are weird. I'm going to go ahead and stand up for a second. My lower back's starting to hurt.
Everyone was running around just a moment ago. Grown-ups are weird. We just bust through that quick. I bust into a boss fight or something. What? I think I lined it up right. There we go. I didn't line it up right. Like that shirt, Millennium Falcon? Thank you. I think it was a Christmas present? Teal Amber Ore, Shiny Pearl, Switch for Door. Hey, good job, kid. Were my chests okay? Just kidding. It's the least I could offer as payment. Thanks for the help. Oh. Welcome. <clears throat> Since the Elder went in, the elevator hasn't returned. I suppose one would just have to jump in. Oh, is that the, was that the issue? Just stole from that man, and he thanked me. I did a good job by stealing. I can't sleep since Malcolm had took over the mines. I fear his minions might attack the town at any moment. Maybe. This whole Malcolm had business is so annoying, I just want to get back to work. Why is everyone angry at Malcolmid? I don't get it. Yeah, maybe we're not asking the right questions here. Welcome to the Sleepy Mason. Would you like to rest in our geothermal room? I, no, I don't like to be hot when I sleep. Seems like the worst room for me. Where's your... Where's your... Glacier room? Fighting an evil wizard was totally on my bucket list. I didn't think we'd go around trying to save a small town, but here we are. Go on meals. And we do need to rest. Off to work. See you next time. Bye, Timmy. Timmy, I should be live tomorrow at the normal time. Right around noon or so. Sounds sweaty and gross, right? Would you like to sleep in our geothermal room? Uh, no. I absolutely would not want to do that. There's a switch on that elevator, by the way. We'll have to try that in a little bit. The water mill stopped functioning after Malcolm had clogged the wind tunnels. There's no more water in the well. I really want to take a bath. Will you go to the mines to help? Probably. So much to learn here. Is this, um... Okay, yeah, that's locked. I can't sleep since Malcolm had took over the mines. I fear his minions might... Okay. That guy's... That guy's either all over the place or they're saying the same thing. Okay. We'll kind of hit this center region of town. Are you really Solstice Warriors? That's so cool. Mom says we can't go out, but it's boring in here. There's nothing to do. It is boring in here. You guys don't even have chests. I can't let my kids go outside with everything going on. It's too dangerous. Heading out, have a look at my equipment and food. Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. So we can upgrade Valerie's. Excited to see what other party members are. I, I know that they've been doing like kind of, not deep dives, but character um, like introductions. Um, and I've, I've been like, but but this is a game that I've been like 100% media blackout on. I, I once I I played the demo, which I didn't even need to play the demo, but I played the demo. I was like, uh huh, yeah, I'm gonna play this game 100%. So I just kind of tuned out a lot. Oh, okay. So we can buy some power ups too. Chance of automatically timing blocks. 
Ensures double hits on regular attacks. Negates enemy defense bonus while casting. Decreases damage taken. Now, are these like... These are relics. Like, I don't know... I mean, I have that one equipped. But these don't take, like, equipment, so I don't think I want to buy the relics. The relics feel like they're more accessibility options, if that makes sense. Hot. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. I haven't even, I haven't even watched reviews. I just, I've, I've looked at some scores, and I'm like, cool, tens and, tens and nines. I, perfect. That's all I needed to see. is this? That's the second weird green thing we've seen. We must be getting some sort of green ability. At least the accessibility options aren't tied to equipment slots. Yes. 100%. Um, that is another thing that I was, I'm not a fan of in Final Fantasy 16. If you want accessibility, you have to give up other things. Um, yeah. I do knock that. Even with all the panic going on, my brother won't come out of his studio. All he does is paint all day long. This will be my best work ever. It's pretty good. This device, this device looks like a pump of sorts. I feel like we've walked past a lot of items that we could check out. See, there's another, that other green stone. We must be getting an ability shortly. Hello. Ancient Molkin Cloak. Teeks might get a story from this. Very cool. If the tunnels keep getting clogged, the wind will stop playing the melody through the mountains. If the sleeper wakes up, we are doomed. Are you the social warriors? I really hope you can defeat Malcolm. Be careful in the mines. Apparently someone spotted a monstrous salamander. Sounds neat. I think that's everything. This looks like a mine entrance. 